Hello and happy Sunday, everyone. <laughs> I hope you're not getting bored with the content. I feel like it's been a lot of books and a lot of DIY type stuff, but you know, when you vlog your everyday life, that's just kind of what happens. You show what's happening. If you've been watching, um, we are in the process of remodeling the um, garage outbuilding that is in our backyard. Um, we are turning it into a fully finished um, schoolroom for my kids as well as a storage area. Um, and today I need to do some computer research. I'm trying to find the best deals on some things I still need to order. Um, I need to order a new bookshelf. The kids are getting new desks. Um, that's actually proving to be kind of a struggle, to be honest. The desks I'm struggling with and every one of them that I have found has either um, been more than I want to pay or I'll put them in my cart and <laughs> then they're gone. Um, but I'm also in the market for um, some uh, area rugs for our little reading area. Um, I would love to get a Persian rug that goes in the center of the room. I need some fabric to put on the cushion that I am making for the bench um, that we're making. I also want to get some um, green throw pillows. Um, I already did get a yellow one and a pink one. Um, and then I want to order the beautiful butterfly print um, that I found at World Market. Um, I'm also looking for some shelves that I may put above the kids' desks. I, we still have two um, here that I might just be able to refinish. Um, but yeah, I'm kind of just looking for things, um, mostly furniture and then a few rugs. At some point I may do window treatments. I'm not 100% sure if I'm gonna do those right now. Um, yeah. I'm also going to get my sketchbook out and kind of just do a rough outline of um, where I think the furniture placement is going to go best. That helps me kind of determine the size um, that I can get for the, for the most part. kind of already have an idea in my head, but I always do best if I can actually sit down, draw it out, take the measurements of the area of the wall. Um, so that I know if I order, you know, a bookshelf, um, it's going to fit where I kind of have it pictured in my head. Um, so yeah, I, uh, I have all the ideas, um, and I'm so excited. I'm trying to be as thrifty as I can. I'm also trying to use several pieces that we already have. Um, if you watched my video from Friday, you know that I repurposed two lamps. Um, and a chair and I will also be repurposing um, two tables and two other chairs. Um, I also have a beautiful bench that used to be my grandmother's um, that was at the end of her bed. Unfortunately the fabric on it is getting a little old um, and doesn't really match the aesthetic that I'm going for so I'm looking at having it recovered um, depending on how much that's going to cost me. And I would love to put the little bench in our reading corner um, that I'm hoping to have like a hanging tent kind of thing from and some lights um, so that the kids can just go in there and read their books. Um, so yeah, I just, I have all these ideas and I'm trying to, I'm trying to not go overboard, trying to be as thrifty and do as much DIY stuff with the things that I can. Um, Again, if you saw the video on Friday, you know that we are creating a bench rather than buying a couch. I had been looking at purchasing a couch, but I don't want to spend upwards of, you know, five, six hundred dollars on a couch when I have these two beautiful antique headboards that I think will be um, beautiful as a day bed. And uh, yeah, I'm really excited to make that bench and get it put together. I actually have a bench on my front porch that my mother made out of an old bed, which was kind of the... Um, inspiration for that um, and so I'm really looking forward to turning those headboards into a couch um, or a bench type thing so yeah I don't know what else we're gonna get up to today um, 
it's just kind of a relaxing Sunday and so I figured better time than any while well, my husband is out working in the garage trying to get things done um, we're getting so close we have to finish framing out some wall pieces um, so that we can put the drywall up as uh, level and as evenly as possible and then beyond that we just have to install the windows um, and it's coming together so we have to put the door in it's gonna be great I will also be we um, my mother-in-law was amazing and purchased a door for us um, and so I'm going to be painting that to match um, the aesthetic that I'm going for I'm thinking about painting in that same pale pink color that I made the chair um, so yeah, it's all coming together. I can't wait to actually show you guys everything all finished. I have picked out my paint color um, and I'm very excited. It is very dark, um, but I think it's going to be beautiful with all of the white and pink and kind of okra mustardy yellow accents and the rose gold um, bronze. So yes, I'm very excited to get all of it kind of pulled together. So hang out with me and let's do a little shopping. So after being unsuccessful trying to find desks for the kids online, my husband had the great idea as he was taking apart this workbench to just repurpose it and build desks for them. So we're gonna go ahead and do that and I'm very excited.
so sorry that I didn't actually close out the vlog yesterday or even post it. Um, we ended up working in the garage until about 10 o'clock um, because our friend Zach was here helping my husband again. They and have to put in the two new windows on the uh, wall that faces our um, yard. We ended up having to basically take the whole wall out and rebuild the wall around the windows because there was a lot of um, wood damage. Um, so they ended up having to just take that whole wall down and reframe um, the wall around the windows. Um, but the two new windows are in and I am so happy. Um, we still have to put the big window in, um, but then beyond that, we just have to do the drywall. I'm so excited. I can't even begin to tell you. Um, but again, I'm so sorry I didn't actually upload this yesterday um, or close it out. So um, thanks for hanging out with us and we will see you again this afternoon.